All right, people. Welcome back. More daily duels. So uh, daily duels. DD. We're playing DD DD. So uh, <laughs> give us a D. <laughs> so I see you. I see, I see that you see the title. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do uh, punny punny things when it comes to DD for its entire life down here, but you know, it's just too. Funny. <laughs> you're gonna run out of puns. I'm, I'm, I'm probably gonna. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna run out of puns. <laughs> All right, uh, so I'm st I'm still new to the deck, so I I I, I gotta I gotta prep prep myself. I gotta I gotta lose my. Uh, you gotta my, get your pre prep right. I I, 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 I I gotta lose my uh, my DDD virginity. So I gotta I gotta prepare for the D. Uh, DD. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, they made the deck, and they, they, they were, they, you, you can't. They were, they were asking for it. They're asking for it. It's too easy. <laughs> it's too easy. Just too easy. Yeah, it's just too easy. So, I kind of, I kind of know what you're supposed to do with the deck. I, I, I wouldn't say, you know, I'm, I'm the DDD master. Yeah, you know, but I kind of know what I'm doing here. So we're gonna go ahead and add the slime and fuse it up because. That's generally like what this deck likes to do. So, uh -huh. go ahead. Fusion Shokan. Fusion Shokan. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and go into yeah her. Oh, go King. All right. I don't know who to send though. And whatever you want. Cause he's good, but then he's good, but then he's. Good. You know, I'm gonna go and send you because I can always summon you back from the graveyard and do my uh, other play. Uh -huh. So you can go up and then you can fuse again, right? Yeah, you bench card from your special one D you should be much From your oh from my hand. Okay. So I, I know you had a, I, I know you had an additional effect. I think that's it for right now. If I take effect damage. Oh, or my opponent can just quit. Okay. Like, I need to get used to this deck. You can't run from the D, I had to give you the D. GG BRB. <laughs> <laughs> Back with more D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D D been great if I would have went first. No, oh, another exactly. quick draw. Okay. Wait a minute. Don't tell me he's gonna go into fucking Nova. Cause he can. Yeah, he can. Uh -huh. I'd say you gonna go into Nova. Are you gonna go into fucking Infinity first turn? Okay, so not thank God. Okay. Whew. <laughs> um, junk Archer? I don't. Know. Oh no, you already had the Junk Sink on. Damn, you opened up the. Why didn't you just summon that and then whatever? Whatever. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I guess you know what you're doing. You opened up the titties. Yeah, he opened up with everything. Everything? Everything. God damn. All he was missing was the Dolph War, and he would open up perfectly to the Quasar the first turn. Seriously. Okay, if you were going to use that, why didn't you just summon Junk Synchron and use the... Never mind. Never. Well, how am I supposed to give you the fucking DDD? How am I supposed to give you the D when you just... Gardner? He opened up so protected. Turbo Warrior. Turbo Warrior. Why not Junk Gardner? Okay. Well. But who goes in a turbo warrior? I don't know. You're in the turbo warrior, and then that's it. Yeah, exactly. Like, okay. All right. All right. I think I got this. I think. Uh -huh. I got this. <laughs> All right. If you think you can, yeah. This pendulum effect is actually good. Both of his effects are good. Both of his effects are good. If I special summon a DDD, I can special summon a DD, a DD from my graveyard, and any bad damage my opponent takes is half, but I still summon it, which is just great. Yeah. And. I, I, it's gonna take me a while to get used to this deck, people. I apologize ahead of time. You guys, if you guys have any suggestions or anything like that, then please go ahead and tell me. But yeah, this this put a step by step guide how to play it at the bottom. Yeah, yeah, just, yeah. Just, just, just give me. Yeah, time. just put step one, step two, step three, win. But <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, don't fuck this up because exactly. Daniel, you don't fuck this mm -hmm. up. All right, so. Why don't you uh, send Leonidas or somebody to the grave? That way, when you send him. Back. Is it just DD? I think it's just DD. I yeah, don't they all fall into the same category? Or Do they? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I, thought, I thought it didn't matter. To fuse summon one D D monster from your extra deck by banishing from your graveyard. Mm -hmm. All right, slime, you're good. Yeah, of course, it's a good word. I'm running this over Lilith because if you, I see people running Lilith, and I was like, if I run Lilith, then I can win this, and it literally does the same thing, and gives my dark touch back, and I don't have to waste my normal time. Time's running out. 
<sighs> yep, yep, mm -hmm. time's running out. So literally, let's just experiment because I, I feel like I'm gonna fuck this up. So, since I feel like I'm gonna fuck this up, let's just go ahead and experiment. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we'll go ahead and summon you from that. Since you're zero attack, like if I can one, if I can one for one you, I might as well go ahead and do it properly. Exactly. So I'll go ahead and get my uh, searcher card. Contract with the rocket. Yep. Contract. Activate contract. What the hell is that in the background of that card? Just like Mega Monarch, evil super, fuck you up in the butt guy. Fuck you up in the butt, guy. Yeah, fuck you up in the butt, guy. That's the uh, name, good right? Time, good times, good times. You remember when, remember when uh, fucking, uh, fuck you up in the butt, guy? Fuck you up in the butt? But, yeah. <laughs> what? what? Alright, we'll go ahead and slam it up. Go ahead and summon. Uh, what, is you, what do you do? You can special summon, I think, a DD monster from Graveyard. Yeah, so if a DD monster is supposed to summon, try to fill the except this card during your damage step. You can target one DD monster in your graveyard for summon it. I don't think I can go to you because I got to handle I still got to handle this situation. Exactly. So we'll go ahead and summon you. Then you will go off, mm -hmm. and you can summon me. I don't know. <laughs> I guess I'll summon you. Summon you. And then you can use your effect, and you're like a foolish, which is also really good. Mm -hmm. I the plays, the plays. I hope I don't fuck this up. Alright, so... I want well, to just send something to the Graveyard to Confuse with, because you already put a Necro Slime in there, didn't you? Yep. Yeah, so. I'll put something in the Graveyard to Confuse with. What can I fuse with? Anything you want. That's the good about this deck. It's all, like, generic-y, kind of. Normally, most of the fusions just say DDD Monster like that, or DDD Monster in this, you know? Mm -hmm. Most of them just say DDD Monsters. But I definitely want to fuse again. Whatever you want. Mm -hmm. Maybe now you could, if you wanted to. Uh, uh, slime. And then... What's that last one do? Piercing, and you can destroy all spell trap cards you players. Don't try to go. That's not bad. During your snowball phase, though. That's not bad. If you want to? Yeah, fuck okay, it. We'll go into him. You. Mm -hmm. Summon. Rawr! Alright, now I'm gonna fuck you up. I'm gonna fuck you up. <laughs> <laughs> With the D. 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 <laughs> you always gotta give it that pun. Oh, really? You give it that pun? <laughs> I'm gonna fuck you up with my D. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck you up with the D. D D. <laughs> I'm toss it at you. Like I said, I don't think that I'm not sure if that play was right, but it wasn't bad. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm gonna toss it at you. Yeah. So, go ahead and tell oh, me. Or that's weird. Yeah, give mm -hmm. me all the instructions. Tell me how to play this deck. This deck's gonna be on here for the next month. I was worried about this deck. I really was. Like DDDs is not the kind of deck you could just hop in and play. Like yeah, you, you, gotta, you gotta know the play. You know, majority of the time when I see people talking about this deck, they're like, "This is one of the most difficult decks I've ever played." <laughs> so right. it is pretty difficult. But as soon as you learn it, you got it. It's like every samurai, and that's it. I told you he was gonna throw it at you. Yeah, saw that coming. That's fine. Hey, at least, Why is this at least man... you can get rid of your contract. I swear to God, how does this man keep on getting the fucking titties? Oh my God. He doesn't have another the... quibble in there, so you're good. All he's going to do is tag you for 700. Wow. So, wait, you pit special and did all that just for that? Yeah, he doesn't have anything left. Why don't you just take it slow and just hold on to your resources? Because he's stupid. And I don't know why he popped your back row instead of your gate. Yeah, because now I'm going to be able to get my search on Exactly. I don't give two fucks if I'm taking the damage. As long as I get pluses. Pluses out the ass. Mm -hmm. hey. <laughs> <You didn't... laughs> <laughs> so that's so probably slime going, going off in the video. video. You want to your hand, but you don't need to do that. Yeah, I don't need to do that. Uh, so. I could do it, but I don't need to do it. I mean, you could. You can add some new, like reunite it if you want to do or yeah. something like that. You know. Hey. 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 One. Ragna. Ragnarok. Ragna. Ragna. Ragnarok. Summon BBD. Summon BBD. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> Nikki, you thought you dark hole of me. I'm coming back with a vengeance. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. This no, is, this this is, this it's one of the things that makes this deck so fucking good. So fucking good. Oh my god, I can actually go into After you see some the rest of the turn, other cards and effects might be activated on kill. Another card effects on kill might be negated once the turn or any player's turn. You can attach one of the same material from this card. Destroy all spell and trap cards on the field. You can attach one of the same material from this card and target one 
our contracts go with our car drivers. Sorry. Ooh. Okay, so you could yeah, do that. Yeah, right? So you could destroy all of them and add one from the graveyard yeah. to your hand. Okay. Fuck okay. it. This is fun. <laughs> yeah. I'm having fun. You, you're fun giving them multiple Ds? Yeah, I, I, dude, dude. Like, I, I, I mean. You can destroy I, all the stolen traps? Yeah. Because I can always get my shit back. Okay. Because I, I don't trust him right now. Uh -huh. <laughs> sure. Does that guy have three Ds in his name? Duo Don no damn two. Duo Don. Hey man, what the heck are you playing? <laughs> <laughs> you making fun of me? No, I'm playing. <laughs> <laughs> Can I activate it? Or wait, I think I fucked up because I think I could reactivate it and get another search. You probably could have because it didn't say you couldn't activate it. Just what I mean. No, I think it does. Yeah, other card effects on the field are negated, and their effects cannot be activated on the field. No, you can activate it. You oh, could have. You could have. Might be. Oh, well, he quit anyway. Yeah, mm -hmm. he quit anyway. I destroyed right. him. He got the tits, but I was prepared. <laughs> he didn't get the tits, he got the D. <laughs> Three times. <laughs> All right, he got the tits, but then I got D, and then he gave me a tit job, and I won. You know how it is, smack titties around the a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's sex, uh, you know, slap her titties around, stick it in her and pee, duh. Uh, duh. Who doesn't know this? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, get another duel. Let's go. So, what was it again? It was GG, BRB, for more DDD. Exactly. <laughs> Alright, let's go again. And right, now I'm not bad. Not bad. <laughs> I'm bad, I'm bad, you know really bad. Oh. And it's not uh, great. It's just... Let's see. Number generator, number generator, number generator. Yep. 60% 60, 60 of my hands, this card that won. So I guess I'll just make it so you can't play Yu Gi Oh! Oh, uh, just set, set, set some back row. Set, set, set some back row all the day long. This guy, I guess he's pretty good. I, so I'm still. I'm still, most of them, other than these, I'm like, yes, three up, three up, three up, yes, 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 yes. But then there's some of them, I'm like, how many, how many do I play? But, you know, uh, Burfermont, how many do I play of that, you know? And, you know, I took precedence, and I do a little bit of research, a little bit of net decking, a little bit of help. But, uh, oh my god, we are about to get the Necros. Oh my god, Necros. Necros, Necros people, Necros. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. Yep, so... Uh, obviously you're trying to trish me. That that that's a given. That's a given. So I'm just gonna flip the vanities. We're gonna take this duel like super slow. Like there's no reason for me to overextend or do nothing. Like vanities. Let's take it slow. Like calm down, Mr. Necro guy. I didn't open up that well. Like I opened up with the hate, but I didn't open up with the combaliciousness. So we're just gonna take the duel slow. All right, there's Burfamon. So it says one per turn. I can target one DD monster I control except for. Uh, but for my, I can cut a level between 1 and 8 if he comes at level until the end of it. So I guess he, he helps with exceed plays. Because he's not really a tuner. I guess he can affect the tuner, which I believe is him. So, if he's in the graveyard, I can go ahead and summon him back with him. And have him create, you make him a different level. So, he can go to exceed plays, or he can go to synchro plays. And we already know that freaking Sikri is like, awesome. Alexander, he's more of a combo play. But Sikrit is awesome, or I can do some XC play, so I can make him 4, and then I can XC into uh, Caesar. So, I guess I'll go ahead and take it slow. I'm wondering if I want to take it slow. Uh, yeah, I, you know what, I have these two, so I'm going to start poking him for 14. I mean, he can't special summon, so the best he can do is summon Manju, and if he wants to summon Manju and crash with me, at least that's after the battle phase, right? Yeah. I still got the Solemn Notice and the Solemn Warning, so if any shit hits the fan, I'm still okay. Yeah. Solemn Warning, of course, isn't that good against Necros. But I definitely know that Solid Notice is, so. Like I said, we'll just go ahead and take it slow. So he pretty much needs to get a you know, manager century because he can't stretch it coming. I was thinking about maybe setting, going into defense, and going defense plays, but if anything, I have to. Whoa, what? DDD Monarchs? Hello? I mean, DDD Monarchs. Uh, Monarch Necros. Necros Monarchs. We can move ne <laughs> Necros Monarchs. Hello? <laughs> All right. Well, I guess I was like, "Oh, yeah, he's playing Necros. I can just lock him down then." He's never mind. He's playing fucking Monarchs. He can just sim like just tribute summon and get over my ass. Like, oh my god. Yep. <laughs> like, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, wait. You're not going to fucking do that play? Like, okay. Oh, this is bad. I really don't want to do this play. He's obviously gonna Monarch Storm for me, so I'm fucked either way. So I might as well go ahead and uh, you know, 
search it up and prepare for the worst. Prepare my anus for the worst. So, <laughs> like this, this is, is I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it, but it's cool. If I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. So let me go ahead and prepare for me getting it. Make sense? That makes sense, that makes sense. Sounded good. Okay. Go ahead and activate this. Um, what do you do again? Throw some a DD monster when I special summon D monster. Ragnarok's so good. Like Ragnarok's great. You're okay. As I said, you, you just replace him with Lilith. Fine is good. So I still need to figure out the ratio of everything. Oh, next play, because I know I'm gonna get it next turn. So I'm trying to debate on what I should do. I think I guess I should go ahead and get a swirl. Yeah, let's just go ahead and get a swirl. We're facing off against a, a deck that you would never think of in a million years. Or you see this? Yeah. What's that? It's I don't know why. It's uh, what do you call it? A vassal. What about it? For the monarchs, right? Yeah. Fixed the week. <laughs> weird. <laughs> it's really weird. <laughs> like what? That's really, really weird. Yep. Nah, that's fun. Okay. Like I said. If you're gonna go off and do your play, then I can't stop you anyway, so let's go ahead and see more of your plays before I hit you with the notice, hit you with the warning. Shoot you in your butt crack. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and hit you with that warning. Yeah, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna lose my vanity anyway, so fuck it. Uh, and there's a and because of the warning and the notice and the judgment, it's the reason why monarchs don't do well and that well in the OCG right now. I'm gonna find a nigga, get to that little bus stop. Shoot him in his motherfucking nutsack. Oh, no, motherfucking nutsack. I don't like you fighting over me. <laughs> uh, yeah, I want to play him. What do you got him doing right now? Something he had you doing yesterday, except we when he got you got a new court, and it's still going Really? Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll go ahead and let Ernie look it up. He, he's doing he's doing the monarch plays. This is this is not bad. Not bad. He's doing the necros, he's doing the monarchs. Oh, drew into that preparation of rights, like Hello? <laughs> like wow. Wow. The plays. There's actually the plays. Yeah, get destroyed. Is that game? I think that might be game, people. Oh my god, that's game. Yep, I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> wow, I'm actually dead. I'm gonna get burned by my freaking contact and die. Ah! <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow, he came back. I, 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 Vanny was him. I was warning him, but nah, he still had the tits. He still had the tits. Like, the necros and the monarchs and the plays, and just, it was too strong. It's too strong. The number generator was too strong on both ends. I finally could survive one more turn. If only I would have had something to heal my life points from the freaking searching. You know? Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get another duel. Bear right back. All right, another duel. That that was bad. I was like, wait a minute, is that enough to get me game? Yep, yep, yep. That's what I get. That I totally had that coming. <laughs> All right, so when you take battle damage up during dungeon, you throw some of this card from your hand. If you do game my points, blah 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 blah. All right, that's fine. So I'll go ahead and play my uh, my dark covenant. Um, uh, I don't know what I should search for. I can only one during your main phase. You can add one DV monster from my deck to my hand. I can use the effect of Dark Covenant gates once per turn. Okay. Okay. So uh, it's debatable on what I should be doing right now. Okay, I can go ahead and take it slow. Get me my uh, Kepler. Okay, Kepler's not bad. Yeah, I'm gonna take it slow. There's no reason for me to. Overextend too much. I got two notices. Like two notices. I know it's like this life point just plays a butt ton of life points, but I got two notices. So if you take effect damage during the so you can destroy this card if you just any effect damage and increase life points instead. Now I'd rather go ahead and wait until Gates goes off and then game the life points to special summon the and I use a twenty six beater. Uh, that's that's not bad. Oh my God, not reasoning. Nothing good comes from reasoning. I I, I tell you the truth personally. I think reasoning should be really limited. Like. And it's dumb in Cosmos, and it's dumb in fucking Inferno. It's like, I'm just, it's just dumb. It's just dumb, people. It's just dumb. <laughs> nah, that's fine. 
So let me guess, you're gonna go ahead and send, uh, uh, I forgot his name. It's been such a long time since I played Infernoid that I forgot his name. No, not Harmadek. Uh, what's his name? No, not Harmadek. <laughs> I just said no, not Harmadek. Uh, I'm not, level four. Clearwing Synchro Dragon. <laughs> I forgot that he was a tuner. He's a tuna. Oh my god, the re-fucking kindling too. That's annoying. That's annoying. That is annoying. <laughs> the rekindling too? Like. Wow. No, not Sedimus. I don't even know why you went to that Sedimus place. Really weird. I mean, at least you're exactly a. Oh, just to summon Sedimus. What does Sedimus do? This card attacks an opponent's monster, you can banish fire. I don't have any monsters, so if you're just gonna hit me for 20 seconds, then I guess I'll take it. I'll take it, I'll take it, but it's like, wow. <sighs> Listen, I, 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 th I think, I think uh, reasoning should be really limited, because it's literally just an enabler. It's an enabler for more damage, more OTKs, and you're really just going to your deck and special summoning the monster. Like, it, it, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. Alright, so that's gonna throw off and it's gonna be like, hey, you're about to get fucked up, and I'll be like, nah, nigga, I'm not gonna get fucked up. Wow, and then he flips up the fucking vanities, like, that's annoying. That's really annoying. <laughs> like, how the fuck am I supposed to deal with this? Like, thank you, fucking vanities. Vanities is one of the most disgusting cards in Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, wow, rekindling and vanities, like, wow, lost to the number generator again. Like, I can't special summon, what do I do? How do I deal with the fucking sediments if I can't special summon? Fucking just lose, like, that's what you do, you fucking lose, like, oh my god, that's annoying. That's annoying. That's annoying. We'll go ahead and get another duel and just go ahead and scoop it out. Like, wow. Thanks. Rekindling and Vanities. Be right back. Ugh. Oh. Like I said, sometimes Vanities just sneaks up and gets you in the butt, and it sucks. <laughs> it literally does. It sucks. It's like, ugh. Oh. You just want to die because fucking DDD. I mean, because Vanities. <laughs> like, it's like, oh, well, it's only at one, but then when it gets you when it's at one, that's when it's just like, oh, oh my god. Anyway, this hand's actually pretty good. I can go ahead and play Ragnarok, then activate my contract, go ahead and fuse it up with these two, summon him. Ragnarok will go ahead and summon me back my Kepler. Kepler gave me my search on, like, with and get. Oh my god, this hand's actually pretty good. It's not bad. Not bad. Uh, Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear? Yep. <laughs> I was like, go ahead and summon Fuzzy Wuzzy. Go ahead and activate your raid upgrade. Wait, why don't you activate Ness? <laughs> to activate Ness first, like, alright. You touch Fuzzy, get the search, then search, Fuzzy, search, like, still don't like Red Raptors. Ah, yeah. They've, they've been on the polls, it's just, you know, they've never won the vote, but, you know, I'm not, I'm not the biggest fan of them. Alright. So, go ahead and get your Vanish Lanies and another Fuzzy Wuzzy. Alright, so, we're gonna go ahead and activate Chew. Activate Chew. You, go ahead and, uh, Fusion Shokan. Yep, go ahead and go on the U. I don't know how to use the other guy properly. Like, if I'm using, if I'm doing him wrong, I probably am. Cause like, I need, I need to like, read him properly. Go ahead and summon you. Without the life points, you get my, get the search on. Uh, no. You get, get a covenant card. Uh, go ahead and give me my, that. Let me read him, like, let me actually read him. I'm running him, but what does he do? Alright, the DD monster is special summoned to your side of the except during dump step, you can target one DD monster in your graveyard special summon that target. Okay. I want to use the effect of blah blah blah, blah. this card is destroyed by battle, or this card in your position is a card effect, you target one dark card in your, in your graveyard, and I got target to your hand. Alright. So, you make sense, you make sense, I, I get you, I get you. Uh, and you're once per turn, right? You can only use the effect of back once per turn, so I think I messed that up. I messed up. I should have fused into the other guy, and then this play, when I fused into summon again, I should have went into and did that play. So I messed up, but it's still good. It's all good in the neighborhood. It's all good. As long as my, uh, my gate survives. So, we're gonna go ahead and activate you. Uh, I guess we can summon another one of you, because why not? Like, oh, and it has to be in my hand. I thought it, I thought it could be on the field. Like, no. So. I can go ahead and go into Big Eye, but what would that do? No. Or I can go ahead and activate Necro Slime to uh, fuse again. And I guess I could banish them to fuse into this guy. Or this guy. 
Once turn this card, the card is an attack and roll on the card. You can target one DD or Dark Eye type control return to your hand. If you do, the card breaks out the monster, there's battling, the card becomes the attack of the combined, blah 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 blah. Alright. So that'll be fine. As long as my uh, Dark Contract survives. Specifically this one. But I'm okay right now. Uh, I'm still, my, I feel like my plays are still bad. And I still haven't got it, got it down, but I'll, I'll get it down soon, people. I apologize. Like I said, if you have any suggestions, any suggestions at all, like do this player, do that player, check this, you know. And if you can, and go ahead and tell me the timestamp, and then tell me the correct play. Like when you did this play here, you should have did this, 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 that. Because you know, I, that's one of the problems with daily duels is that you know you guys suggest it, I gotta play it. Well, I don't have to play it, but you know that's just the I, that's just the way I like doing it right now. And so I decided to play it. And uh, I gotta learn it, you know, I gotta learn it. And uh, if you guys are wondering, like, you know, how do you do this? Do you, like, do you sit down and you play test and you play test and you play? No. I make the deck and then I hop into it. And if I fuck it up, I fuck it up. If I don't, I don't. I, I don't really play a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! outside of recording. Yeah, just to go ahead and tell you guys that I don't. I really don't. <laughs> so, are we gonna go ahead and, yep, I love to say, are we gonna have to see the, ri the Rise Falcon? Oh, ooh! Wow, so I'm gonna get Infinity and I'm gonna get fucking, uh... Uh, that, like that, that's fun. No, this Revolution Falcon. All right, the Rise Falcon and Revolution Falcon. That, that hurts. That hurts. I'm about to get fucking destroyed, de fucking destroyed. Like fucking Rise Falcon is gonna be so fucking strong, so fucking strong. <laughs> yeah. So go ahead and wreck me. I have these special summon monsters. Ow. <laughs> I think you did that wrong. Shouldn't you have came at me with the Rise Falcon, not the the Revolution Falcon? I think you did that wrong. I'm not, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna pass judgment. It just seems like you did that wrong. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he's just gonna quit. I'm like, did you do that wrong? Alright, so, literally, I cut a win. Uh, go ahead and activate my Dark Contract, search for another uh, Ragnarok. Then, I could have activated my Dark Slime, banish Special Summon my Ragnarok. Ragnarok would go off, Ragnarok would go off, Special Summon my two fusion monsters back, XC those two. Like, I could have went off again, because he didn't finish me. Like, you fucked that up. Like, I had, look at all this juicy freaking attack. Look, like, freaking Rise Falcons ready to me up, and you're like, poke for 100? Like, nah, you fucked up. I'm gonna get one more duel, just because that guy fucked up. Be right back. Alright, last duel of the video. So, like I said, I'm starting to get, I'm starting to get used to the D, the D, D, D. I'm starting to get used to it. Alright, this hand's not fantastic. Ooh! Alright, Quackies. Oh. Never mind, it's fucking rock stun. I thought it was actually some Quacky. I thought we were about to actually have fun. Oh my god, he opens up in multiple fucking cores and shit. Like, no, never mind. We're not. We're just gonna get stunned to death. <laughs> so, who are you summoning? Alright. Destroy, reveal to me. Alright. Uh, during the approach turn, monster would be special summon. Monsters would be special summon. I can go ahead and tribute to negate. All right, that's fine. Hmm. Hmm. It's debatable. It's debatable. I could just, I could literally just throw Regeki at him because this, this guy's more trouble than he's worth. So I'm going Regeki then. Then Mathematician send. All right. This card's in your graveyard. Special summon DPD monster from my hand. Or I didn't really open up that well. I really didn't. Uh, I'm going special summon. It's not really on that many plays. Ah, uh, it's difficult. It's really difficult. I think I might want to go ahead and send. Uh, uh, what's it called? Slime. Like I said, I think I'm gonna take it slow. I'm gonna take it slow. Run seven normal seven mathematician. Okay, is that back or something stop me? This is only one special summon, right? No, it's just a monster be summon, period. Alright, you wanna stop my mathematician? It's up to you. <laughs> it's all it's up to you. Uh I'll go ahead and send Necro Slime, because Necro Slime can go ahead and do the Ragnarok plate. Uh, I'll hold on to the Ragnarok for, for right now. Uh, I didn't open up fantastic. I'll hold on to Regeki. 
Even though I think he might have the one that blocks spell cards, I'd have to see. He's kind of slow, so hopefully I'll be able to go off. But it's it's, it's tributing monsters slow plus back row, so. So he's gonna go ahead and banish to block his clock human monster from destruction. What do you do? My right, trap card is activated. Okay, well, I'm a counter trap, so you can't even fucking negate me, even if you wanted to. So I'll take that 400. Yes, I'll draw a card. No. And it's card. It's card in your hand. You can use some if you want to have to your monster from your hand. This is much include, including this card. Okay. And this is. You can banish this card from your graveyard. This turn, cutting your monster control. I think you're only spelled to be one, so I think if I were Geki, you would still go. I think. I wanna say yes. Uh, I wanna say yes. Let me go ahead and use it. Geki? I don't think you can use core during my turn. I think it's only during your turn. Yeah, it's only during your turn. Alright, so. Ironically, I drew a slime and I didn't want to draw a slime, because it's fine, so. Uh, we'll go ahead and just, uh, fusion it up, so. Uh, Fusion Shell Gun? Go ahead and flip up that Vanities. Go ahead and flip it up. I know you got it, yep. <laughs> so go ahead and flip up the fucking Vanities. How did I know you had it? How did I know you fucking had it? Like, that's annoying. Alright, so I guess I'll go ahead and just summon Birth of Mind and Poke. I was, like, I was like, let me guess, you have Vanities, right? Of course I do. <laughs> Not much of you since notice right now. I'll poke you 14. You wanna hit me with Mirror Force or something like that? Hit me with the Mirror Force, hit me with the something? And I can't even use my fucking notices correctly. Like, that's that's gonna be annoying, too. Like, all he has to do is just normal summon and poke the sh shit out of me. Mm-hmm. That's that fucking Vanities. That's it's probably one of the most annoying new cards in Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, Vanity should be banned, Regeki should be banned, because they're really just sacky cards. Like, like there's, no, there's no bad side to them. They're only good. Like, don't you think sh there should be some give and take with it? But no, there's no give and take with it. Not at all. So, I can't even play Yu-Gi-Oh right now. Once again, I lost because of Vanities. Like, wow. That's fun. Fucking Vanities. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> it's just like, what's up? where's the downside? Like, huh, flip it up. No one, you can't special summon. It's like, but everybody in Yu-Gi-Oh special summon. No, it should be banned. Shouldn't even have the opportunity to pull that off. Because it just wins you the game. It's like, literally, you draw it, and if you pull off the right time, you win. It's literally an auto-win card in the right situations. It's like, wow, that's fair. What's the negative side to it? Nothing. Nothing, really. Like, oh, you can't special summon too, but yeah, but when you play it, yeah. It's just like, nah. nah. But Vanity's generic. Like, Overdose, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Overdose is more like a... No, I, I don't read it. It's, it is more like a Horn of Heaven. Not of Vanities. I mean, Vanities is a blanket floodgate that says, Hey, you can't play Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah. You know, at least Overdose, you got it. You're going with me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's not a floodgate. Yeah. You tribute your monster. I. It's gone. I don't have to deal with it anymore. It's gone. What? <laughs> no. Like, it's gone. It, you tribute. It's gone. I'm done with it. Vanities. Literally, unless I have like an MST or a Regeki or something, I can't deal with vanities. If it was anything but vanities, I'd be fine. But it's vanities, which makes it dumb. Like I lose, I lose. I already used my Regeki, so I literally have nothing. I don't, I don't run Dark Hole. I don't run none of that. Like at least Fossil Dine is a fucking monster that I can attack over. I don't have anything to attack over, right? But at least it's a monster I can attack over. Unlike vanities, like so. Hopefully, I can draw into like maybe like a Burfermon or something and attack over this Fossil Dine. That'd be great. That'd be that'd be fantastic. I doubt I will, but no. <laughs> yeah, I doubt I will, but it'd been great if I did. So, oh, there we go. Lost two duels in this video because of vanities. Thanks to number generator and fucking vanities. 
So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Like I said, if you guys have any suggestions, go ahead and tell me in the comment section below. So uh, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support. I really do appreciate it. Uh, we'll have fun with DDDs for the next month or so, and then if you guys want more DDDs, go ahead and vote for it on the January uh, straw poll. So uh, I'll be back tomorrow with another deck. I believe tomorrow is what's tomorrow? Tomorrow is Dynamis. Tomorrow is Dynamis, and of course the deck profile for Kaiser Utopia. More deck profiles, more decks uh, all this week. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support. Let me go ahead and surrender my button, that's it. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow with all more digital stuff. I don't know how to end this video. Alright, thanks for watching.